Hi, my name is Nikima Prophet. I'm a developer advocate at PayPal. In this video, we'll take a look at the error logs you can find on the PayPal developer dashboard. There are several ways to reach the error logs page. You can click error logs under the event logs menu item. Or on the home page of the dashboard, you can close the onboarding banner to reveal a count of errors found within the selected date range. Clicking the link here, or clicking the view error logs link from the menu on that badge will take you to the error logs page. You can also scroll down to the recent error logs section on the home page and click view all. On the error logs page, you'll see that each error is logged with date and time, status, debug ID, event type, and a description. Clicking the link to debug ID will show even more information about the error, including the request body and the response. Next, I'll demonstrate an unsuccessful API call using Postman. Once I create the error, there will be a new entry in the error log. I'm making a call to the orders API and I expect that it will return a 400 bad request response. Here I'll send that request and get the error response as expected. Now we can see the error is logged on the developer dashboard. If we scroll through the errors, you'll notice that webhook errors are logged here as well. You can tell which errors are from webhooks because the debug IDs start with WH dash. When you click that debug ID, you can see a detail view that includes the message payload. This has been a look at error logs on the PayPal developer dashboard. Thanks for watching.